St. Louis, Missouri, and I'm a minister of music and church administrator at a Presbyterian church there. I decided to participate in the Volunteer and Community program because I had been interested in Benedictine spirituality and I wanted to learn more about this particular ecumenical community. Hi, I'm Hannah and I'm a college student in Georgia and I'm studying religion. I decided to come to the Volunteer and Community program because I was studying so much of the monastic culture and life and texts and I really wanted to see how it was lived out today. So I thought it was such a great opportunity to come and actually live it for a month. My name is Tisha. I'm uh, currently in between jobs right now. I'm uh, feeling like I'm in the midst of a life transformation. I came here to really pause and I think it's a gift to be able to hit that pause button and to be able to really listen to God and understand and hopefully follow um, the path that he wants us to be on. My name is Noreen and I'm a media consultant from New Jersey. I decided to come to the program because I often, pretty much every year I take time off during the summer to volunteer somewhere. Sometimes it's a short-term missions trip. Um, but then I read about this program and being able to spend time in a monastery with uh, sisters. Mm -hmm. I mean, I just felt like this was a perfect combination of doing what I love to do, which is volunteering, helping, giving back, um, but also in a spiritual Christian environment. My name's Tara, and I'm from East Texas, and I'm a music teacher, and I live with my daughter, Emma, who's a college student. I decided to be a volunteer in community because I fell in love with the community when I saw their website. I thought their website was really attractive and I wanted to get to know the community and the sisters better because um, I really sh am interested in their ecumenical vision and their care for the earth and not many monasteries that I know of have a really organized volunteer program. 